Safety matters, and because snow is such a novelty in the South, many kids love the chance to get out and play in it. But a local doctor is reminding parents of what can happen if kids are out in the snow and cold too long. NBC6's Darren Todd joins us now live at Willis-Knighton. Darren, good evening. What did the doctor tell you? Hey, good evening, Dan and Jackie. The doctor tells me that if people are, if their skin exposed in the snow as well as the cold weather for long periods of time, it can kind of have a negative side effect. Now, you guys can tell it's still cold out here. We still have a long way to go. And he says that people should time how long they're outside or even their kids are outside to prevent any type of harmful winter injury. Frankly, I'm kind of positive. I want people to, I don't want to scare people. I want them to enjoy the snow. We don't get it much here. And Dr. Richard Jacobson is the medical director of Willis Knight's emergency room. He says as people play in the snow and create memories, they can also be doing some harm. Last night, I think it was four or two degrees. Uh, that's plenty cold to cause frostbite, plenty cold. Most people are concerned uh, or know a frost nip. That's when your skin is exposed to cold temperatures for too long and you start to lose filling in your hands, feet, ears, or nose, all signifying it's time to put away the snow boots and get inside. Frostbite is a full thickness freeze to the skin itself. Horrible frostbite goes all the way to the bone. I would be surprised if that occurred here, uh, but could. If you ignore these two signs and you stay out in the cold, you'll be bringing a life-threatening condition into play. Hypothermia typically starts, uh, it's basically the core temperature of the body uh, gets too cold. So how long should parents allow their kids to stay outside and play in snow? Here, uh, I would say check on your kids every 15 to 30 minutes. Be with them if you can. All day outside in 22 degree weather, that is, there is some risk there. Now, so far, the hospital said that they don't have any of their patients with any of these conditions right now. But guys, the cold is still going to stay here. We still have the rest of the week to go. And the doctor says that he wants people to continue to create these fun memories, but do so safely. Live in Shreveport, Darren Todd, NBC6 News. That's right. Use common sense. Smart. Darren, thanks so much.